I had a couple questions about motivation and staying on track. A couple people uh, basically were saying you know, they got injured, they got sick, they got thrown off course, they got married. <laughs> life happens and life can definitely interfere with some of the things that we love to do. But part of all this, part of the reason why I never stop, what keeps me motivated, what keeps me going, is I always try to look at it like this. I try to think, who am I? It's going to get a little deep. Hope you don't get teary-eyed. Think about that for a minute. Who are you? Who are you? Who the hell are you? Think about it for a minute. You know, are you are you the person your parents named named you after? Are you that name? Do you represent that name? Who are you uh, is not determined by who you want to be necessarily. It's determined by people's perception of you. Perception is reality. How do people perceive you? People talk about you coming into work. What do they talk about? What do they say about you? And you're not stepping up. You're not putting in your time. Are people saying that about you? I don't want people saying that about me. I put a lot of time into this. I'm no tough guy. I'm no, spe I'm no special person. I'm a lifter. So when I step into the gym, I'm trying to bring it every single time. Start thinking about, you know, not only what other people are going to think of you, but how you're going to think about yourself. They say success breeds success, right? For every successful moment you have, you can think of it as a giant fucking pat on the back. Who are you? Who are you? Who the hell are you? <laughs>